This is the first time I have ever taken a company charter and I would thoroughly recommend it to other people. Even if you've been once or, or twice or three times, it's a perfect way to spend a day. I would, uh, I would certainly recommend using the Ecolet chartering facility for even our corporate events, which we've never really run before. And if this is the standard, then other chartering companies have got a lot to look up for. We turned up at about quarter to nine, nine o'clock. There were pastries, coffee, tea, bacon sandwiches, everything that you can imagine. Everybody met each other and because it's not a huge group, it's very good. So we were able to talk to everybody and introduce ourselves. We then set towards cows and we all had a chance to do a bit of work if we wanted to. Uh, if we didn't want to, we didn't have to, so that was fantastic. Cows Week, as far as the calendar goes, it's one of the better parts of the whole year. And sailing mixed towards sailing vessels makes it even more memorable. As far as I was concerned, not just coming out on the boat, but getting away from the office, and of course seeing all the different uh, types of sailing craft, means it's something you're always going, going to live with. I'd recommend it to anybody. It's, it's a very good mix as far as I'm concerned. It works very well. People are relaxed, they're enjoying themselves. They can get involved if they want to, not if they don't. Um, one of the things I think is important these days, and we found it's very important, is actually to have a very good lunch with it, because otherwise you are wasting your time and effort, really. And if you don't put a decent lunch on, that to me is, is wasting, you know, spoiling the ship for hate for the tar, really. So um, we had a lovely lunch, a glass of wine, um, and a thoroughly enjoyable day that I think everybody will go away remembering and I think that's very important. You don't want people <coughs> fussing around you but at the same time you do want people you know, offering you a drink if you need it, making sure that you've got water when you need it because you do get dried out on the boat. Um, it's about getting the right balance and I think you've got it really well on this boat. It, it works really exceptionally well. If for any reason you decide to part company with a vessel, yeah, please shout loudly as you go. Yeah, I don't care what you shout, but just make sure somebody's heard. If you see someone go over the side... Mark, to me, is, is, is an excellent skipper. He's very laid back. He likes to get people involved if they want to get involved. He's let, tried to encourage everybody at helm. He's tried to keep people involved, but he's not been pushy about it, and that has worked really well. One of the things that always people are concerned about is what's it going to be like on the day. Is the person in charge, the man in charge, knows what he's going to do and i found that Mark has been uh, met up to all expectations, helpful and very friendly, which is important because people don't know what the day is going to be like. And someone giving good instruction, which he's done and made some people do some work, it's again made it worthwhile. It, it's just been a really good Day. Everybody's bonded really well, and although most of us didn't know each other at the start, we all got to know each other quite well, so I think it was just the right mix. I would bring other clients here, absolutely, yes. I'd definitely do it again.